Welcome to Starfinder, the Fragments of Eternity. It is session 44. It's the 9th of March, 2020. I'm Ryan, the GM, and here are Hello, the Ryan. players. And here oh, are the dude. players, Colin. Hi, it's me, your boy. No, it's not. Weird. Hi, your boy. I'm you go here. And I play <laughs> Weird, the new Android, new mechanic. I've been usurped. Hello. I'm Colin, and I play Lyco, the uh, sturdy, reliable, same old, same old uh, space cop, 90210, Babylon 5. I am a captain, and I do not accept this thing of the placements and the speakings of the intros. <laughs> it's unacceptable. Evil Ludwig's <laughs> about to come out soon. He <laughs> <Maybe> wants that. <laughs> For more information on Ludwig, please see the Origin game, also available from Tales of Triumph. I will have my revenge. And I am Nico. I play Zora, Vest Cap. In this life or the next. Thank you. <laughs> Hello. Hello. I'm Callum. Hello, I'll be playing Zig. The space rat from the sun. Mm. I will allow Mystic, it. legend, and goodness. <laughs> <laughs> sure. Oh dear. Good day. Um, <laughs> Good day. O- honestly, see if someone has listened to us for this long. Please let us know, like, because you deserve a medal or something. Possibly. Hello, and uh, also goodbye. So, yeah. The hello, hello. The Beatles. <laughs> That's not what they said. <laughs> Just in case anyone was but, like, misguided. Led astray. Much like I have been led so. far away from the path chosen for me. <laughs> oh, God. Right, so that was an intro. Um... Was it? No, should we really. start again? I mean, should we no, start again? Yeah. No, we're, well, okay, if that, if let's, I think we should. I, I should be first. Right. To be honest. Let's do it once more. Right. Just done a few good one. Hey, I'm Nico. And I'm Zora. Why was it so weird? <laughs> wow. Um, I know I'm Zora. Sorry. Hi. Sorry, they fucked. <clears throat> I'm Alex, and I'm hey. weird. <laughs> hi. 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 <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yes. <laughs> Second time oh. the same saying doesn't go. Does it go? Uh, no. <laughs> Nah, I wish we'd just skip this and just go right to the game now, man. Yeah, let's get to that. Sorry, Zach. The second time feels weird, man. Wow. <laughs> Title of your sex tape. <laughs> <laughs> Dive into the action. The action is a cooling, clear, crystal clear lake amidst the Sahara of our... Does anyone know what the fuck he's on about? I've oh, oh, 44 idea. sessions and still no. <laughs> I have no idea. I have no idea, Alex. I don't know. Yeah, so I think we're going to say no to that. Um, Wait, let's get back, right? Uh, let's go. Reset. <laughs> so, yep. Hi, I'm Ryan, the GM. The founder. Please send help. Um <laughs> Okay, so goals, right? And oh, let, in fact, no. What we'll do is we'll talk about last week first. I think that's what we normally do. Um, so, what happened last time? What did it say? Last time, nothing of interest. Yeah, not nothing, really, man. Nothing. It was pretty tame. I'm pretty yeah, well, went to the same. Oh, pardon me. To see a marching band. <laughs> Were you a young boy? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> but yes. Anyway, uh, I Nick's five ceased to be. He is an ex android. And mm. he has now gone through his apotheosis. Mm. Um, and is weird. 
Yeah, very much so, in fact. Um, mm. yeah. now, now with added arms. Yes, indeed. Um, and fewer eyes, as we discussed. Yeah, the eyes thing. It's, um, Less eyes. <laughs> yeah, you lost your, your awesome dark vision. Um, yeah, but don't worry, I'll get it back. I was going to say, yeah, we'll get it back. It's fine. That's a good thing about eyes, they're two a penny. <laughs> get me a pair as well, we'll get a pair. That's one, man. Yeah. Yeah, that's one, man. Cool. 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 Oh, I've got to go. <laughs> I'll go my eye go. I wonder about one, no. <laughs> uh, yeah, so does MD actually remember what happened last time beyond the next five uh, becoming weird metamorphoses? Uh, we did sort of land a bit mad about their glass. We decided to land mm-hmm. a bit about their glass again. I remember it was like a, a fad I sort of remember much. So what I you're saying is you think things. you learned more about her glass? We can't. Uh, we did. Definitely. We may really not have. Uh, it just never sunk into my, my napper because um, <laughs> my napper. You know. mm-hmm. Yep. Translation <laughs> for those at home uh, is on our highest level Patreon. So you're not having it. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. I don't like the language region. Mm-hmm. Or Scottish, probably. Probably the, the ancient and proud language of Glaswegian. <laughs> to be fair, I may as well add that into Starfinder, given that you still have a lot of language picks to take. Um... Listen, sometimes a man just needs free languages. Just yeah. floating about. As in free, free not three. Uh, either <laughs> or, and both. Uh, but meanwhile, anything else happened that was noteworthy or important? Uh, I drowned almost. Mm-hmm. You drowned. Drowned. Yeah, ghosts. Mm-hmm. Well, you got some lore revelations. The two of you that were on the yep. other yeah. side of the Nix Five and Zig got some lore revelations yes. before um, Weird emerged. That is true. Queer is failed Nix. Yes, yes. That's how I did it. Anyway. Nix, yeah. Mm-hmm. This Nix is the best Nix, not the evil Nix. Yeah, did they tell did you tell them you did a good tea? No. <laughs> <laughs> no comment. Yeah. Um I don't think he was evil. I think he was just uh he was a bit of a fuck sorry, up. Sorry, he was all like coughing to my fucking You were. Like, That's fine. What about sorry. the revelations that he's got from Query then? What did he learn? Everything's gonna end. The end is nigh. Okay. It's bad. Uh, uh glass ruined everything. Mm-hmm. As Lance Archer's theme tune says, EVERYBODY DIES! You know. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It's true. That is 100%. But true. also, apparently, we've just got to fucking off ourselves or something to make the world fine, so that'll be easy. <laughs> right? No, because you'd probably get too high AC to hit yourselves now. <laughs> <laughs> Not yet, I still need new armor. We became too strong! <laughs> Did none of you think to take your armor off? Well, well, no, it'd be cold. Um, <laughs> yeah, so yeah, you le- learned some uh, interesting stuff about the other world that uh, Query seems to come from, or the other place he seems to come from. You've learned a lot about Orgolas. You've had more chats. Yeah, so what we had was about his Orgolas. <laughs> mm-hmm. Or was that about Orgolas? <laughs> it wasn't cold Orgolas, it was cold Bob. And, uh, or so whatever it may actually have been called. I just I just said Bob because I couldn't remember if we were told a name, but I don't think we were. Were we? Nope. There was no name given. No. Um, there you go. The So in a sense I was right. In a very, very Colin sense, yeah. And um mm. uh, Zig was taught how to tell the time with the stick and the sun. Yes. <laughs> that was that one really confusing very fast. Yep. Um that was adorable. Um, you taught the Drow Queen some uh, some numbers in your okay. Did mm-hmm. so that's a start of her processing that language. Um, yeah, you have all finally left the haunted palace. Um, and oh yeah, mm-hmm. and we're just, oh. and you carry on in one of the main cities of Castroville with the goal to do something. But speaking of goals, let us all view our goals. Hey. So. Hey. No, the power of Segway. Right, Nico, goal number one. What is, what, what is it? Get back, how we doing? get back to the final hour and regroup and be brief. 
Cool, cool. And it is fine. A uh, weird. Uh, something about weapons, right? Uh, make weapons to kill Hamani and store them safely. Happy with that still? Yes. Okay. I am the weapon. I mean, again, a few. You're definitely a weapon. Yeah, I was gonna say. No, you fucking weapon. <laughs> <laughs> oh, weapon. <laughs> again, translation, and that is yep. level pigeon. Yep, yep. I... Why do I suffer through these people? <laughs> what do you mean, these people? <laughs> what do you mean, these people? <laughs> uh, right, uh, Lyco, number four? Yeah, so that was uh, number four. Uh, yeah, yeah, so gather intel, uh, and this is towards the uh, the next objective, or target, mm -hmm. whichever you prefer. And then Zip, and all five. that cheap, cheap stuff. <laughs> Explore a possible connection between the S and V eggs. That's so important for those who are concerned. Yes, yes. That's good. And then yes. three, which is just gain a valuable ally against Demogesh, which is the overall generic goal. Good. Anybody want to change them all, tweak them all, or happy as is? Change I would just delete them all, man. I would just delete them all, man. Just start again. Uh, right, give me five new goals. Let's... Nico. Let's go fucking find them all. Smash as he's done, that's the second goal. Uh, take over uh, Aspis. Aspis. Yeah, mm -hmm. take over Aspis. Gain a moon. Okay. And destroy them, I guess. It's alright, yeah, it's fine. Five goals later, man. Nah, that's not bad. Yeah. <laughs> right, so, is that my <laughs> second campaign you want me to run? Because that's about a campaign <laughs> worth of stuff there. <laughs> <laughs> Is this uh, yes, where we do like a little save point? This is where it branches off into two different endings, and we we'll, we'll go back at the end to <laughs> what the, the to, regret to the other end. <laughs> yeah. uh, no, we don't do that. Sadly, um, rats. Yeah. Indeed. Right. Okay. Well, if we're all happy with our goals, that's good. We'll uh, keep them as is, and then we will go back to our place in the city of Castreville. So we fade in. There's the noise, the hustle and bustle of a major city, obviously with a major spaceport, and yeah. Who does what as you all kind of come to from the shimmering of teleportation? Uh, so, uh, I don't know, do people notice that we've just teleported in? It's not really that uncommon. <laughs> okay. uh, it's, it's a fantasy world. Yes. <clears throat> Like, it's probably inconvenient, because um, there's probably etiquette to it, right? Especially in somewhere as, like, um, metropolitan as Castroville. But it's also not uncommon, annoyingly. You're not allowed to, like, teleport right inside someone. Yeah, like, teleporting into, like, someone's shop's rude, right? Because that's, like, illegal. Um, because of breaking and entering and shit like that, so... I should be in this day and age, maybe like wards or something that would stop that, maybe? It's also just like driving on the pavement equivalent, right? You just don't do it because it's not for your yeah, car. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, don't break crimes. Yeah. Like, people don't break crimes. Right? Oh, don't break, break laws, sorry. Yeah, it's okay, they don't break crimes. Break the crimes! They don't break, break crimes. crimes, that's fine. Yep. Um, well, I would probably... <laughs> I mean... I guess I would... I'm not actually 100% sure. What, how am I going to react to just suddenly being in the street? Yeah, because it's probably like quite the headache, isn't it, from the solitude that you've had for a while? I don't know. Turn the music on in my helmet then. <laughs> I think I'll be alright, but I think I'm pretty used to getting fucking wormholed a bit and warped a bit. Like, Remember, you've not, you've not adjusted your armor yet, Nix, for as far as I haven't. Or I know. Weird, sorry. So I'm standing there in my kilt in my cape. Yep. <laughs> looking majestic because you've got like a suit of armour under one hand and then your uh, body of SK over your shoulder yep yep and two free hands so <laughs> I feel like I would pose the question then do we try and communicate the ship to the ship for here or do we point towards the space port do we try and get a lift to Akaton and or go away for there. How is the queen reacting? She's um, kind of standing, looking around, like that scene when Captain America runs out to Times Square. 
Mm-hmm. That makes sense. Just looking around. And it's not that she looks shocked or out of place. She, you can just clearly tell she's taking in as much as she possibly can. Well, in that case, um, if I think I can interrupt her and actually get her attention, uh, I will probably say something like, uh, must be uh, must be pretty different from what you remember. And then as she's still looking around, she goes, different, yes, less inspired. And she's still like, looking around. Right. We are, where are we heading first? Spaceport of some description, or are we actually going to do anything here first? Yeah, what's everybody's plan? It's like I said, it depends if I had to just get in touch with a ship for here. We could we just get the ship to come. We'll have this conversation in character, then it's probably the best, best way to go ahead. So maybe <clears> Arthur <throat> does pose that question to the captain. Well, yeah, I, 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 I'll, I'll, I'll put it in, in like words. Uh, so. Where's our where's our first port of call, Captain? Well, it depends if it's possible to get in touch with the ship. It might be best to just get it to come to us. It might give weird, weird. He'd, yes. he'd like lift his eye, eyebrow. Like, you know, like not good, right? <laughs> Uh, popular ridge. <laughs> yeah, I would give a big give weird time to adjust. Yeah, so I could do with adjusting my armor. Question <laughs> is, would it be possible to get in touch with the ship here? Mm, I, think I don't see why not. It's certainly be possible. It's, it may be detected. Question, I suppose, is is there anywhere we can go that won't, you know, I uh, I don't know how uh, how much we can we can travel about without drawing attention to ourselves. Assuming anyone is looking, I mean, well, we can probably safely assume. Some people I don't think I'll be recognised. Probably not. <sighs> he's true. he's not wrong. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't know about that. You um, start the group are starting to get some strange looks, mostly because there's a giant golden egg <laughs> and a body over someone's shoulder. Perhaps we find an alleyway. <laughs> Traditionally, the least suspicious place to conduct business. I like to think. Of that. <laughs> Why don't we go get some food? Uh, we could always just boil up the egg. Because they could give the captain a dirty ass <laughs> where I'm like, no. no. <laughs> yeah, actually, I could you do You take a something. defensive stance in between the captain and the egg. But just think about it. If, like, dragons drink DNA, what, what, what happens if we do it? <laughs> drink captain. a dragon. <laughs> captain, I think, I think you'll find a lot of... I mean, pretty much all food is, is DNA in it, but... Uh, I was actually been joking. <laughs> I was actually being <laughs> it's, hard, it's hard to tell. It's hard. To... I suppose I it's a, a gesture to the queen and like, why don't we? Uh, why don't we uh, treat her Majesty to some of her uh, of her her land's new modern cuisine? <laughs> Is my eyebrow. Um, it's really difficult for a Vesk that have no eyebrows. Mm, yeah, my ocular ridge. <laughs> ocular ridge. I keep on my like, ocular ridge. Why do you think you got here all of a sudden, Zora? Like, uh, because <laughs> I keep. I, I don't know. Right? <laughs> ocular ridge is also a term for eyebrow. <laughs> <laughs> Use me some some food, I guess. Now, what are we going to do about uh, you know, Furler? Oh fuck! <laughs> 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 I'm 
I'm getting up at the dead body. I'm riding the dead body, um, but... <laughs> perhaps we should find the local branch of the Church of Abadar. And, uh... Yeah. Deposit that's... her there. <laughs> that's a I... fucking idea. That's a terrible okay, I'll, I'll way to How dare you? How dare you? You thought I wouldn't notice. But I did. That's why I snickered, Dan. I could It took a lot to, like... Keep a straight face. <laughs> <laughs> the only problem is, though, like you're gonna turn up to like a place of employment with a dead yeah, with body. a dead body. Yeah, and, and there's, there's how are they gonna just not assume you did it? As a well, voice. I mean, we'll we'll speak to them. <laughs> I'll be looking on my I'll use device. My charisma. I just oh, like the way yeah. you instantly solved that very problem well with in the utterly book. nothing. Can, we'll just we'll speak to them. They'll understand. Yeah, hey, look. We're talking. Talk. My charisma. Um, well, yeah, uh, we'll let the captain speak to the church. I will yeah, do it. Would... it. would actually be a good fucking use in my diplomacy skill because, like, that's actually a, a use I can see mechanically being useful for. Flashback <laughs> to every time you spoke to anyone in this game. Yep. Uh, yeah, I mean, I've not really ever had to, like, confirm my honesty to somebody. Mm. True that. Right, so, what is the first plan? What is it? step one? Right? Uh, you do... I'm looking for the location of the nearest church. Cool. Uh, how do you want to do that? Because you just, you, you're obviously you've been connected to the Castrovel network, so you could just yeah, I'm going to Google Chrome it. Mm -hmm. It's um, easy to do. Like it literally just takes the length of time it would take you to type it in, right? So cool. Yeah. You can navigate. By. Are we nearby? I mean, narratively near enough by. It's like not particularly far away. Um, but again, you're in like a major city, so there's loads of. Uh, everything's really here that you would likely need. Mm -hmm. So, is everything going? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Following the crowd. I'm yeah, go. I'm, I'm. And you're going to walk I'm through the, with the, the city with a dead body. Uh huh. And, and an egg. Going egg. Oh, like stuff it in your portable box thing. Oh, it's full, damn it. <laughs> it's full yeah. of a dead dragon. The egg <laughs> is, uh. Should we leave the egg with them? Because rolling that around the city is. It's gonna get you noticed. I just. I wonder if they, uh. Also, rolling it around the city is probably really bad for the egg. Mm, possibly. I wonder if they might be better positioned to take care of it than we are at the moment. Let's have flashbacks of the void egg. And... You can open an account. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we could. We better get there first, though. I'm not super comfortable with just leaving it <laughs> with someone. Uh, uh, <laughs> okay, we're just coming. I've yeah, sure. seen an app, yeah, actually. It's like, I get what you're coming for. But, in a situation like Hermani or Urgla showing up, do you think that we could protect it? I think uh. at that point, like, you hear, like, Zig exhale and the Queen's voice permeates the conversation. She says, Why did you fail last time? <sighs> it just feels like they're on a different level. Like she's uh, clearly like processing everything that's going on in terms of like your conversation. She's still trying to take in everything around her, and she says, "We are drawing attention." I would nod. We should get out of here. Yeah, and uh, we should perhaps consider. Well, there will be people that we will need to introduce you to throughout the uh, system, but it's perhaps also important that you uh reintroduce yourself to your you know your subjects 
she kind of gives you like the most politest like smile that crosses her face to acknowledge you spoke to her and it passes back to okay. her just looking around as, as if to say that's true but I don't really want to talk about it okay <laughs> and she's still again she's mostly just looking at like because there's obviously there's like thousands of people around you right like this place is yeah. as I say it's a massive city um, and you're kind of like in this swell of skyscrapers and also you just hear the the, the kind of thrumming of uh, engines above uh, from a nearby spaceport and you're about half an hour's like walk away from the Church of Abadar kind of bank and yeah like it's half an hour away of city where you'd need to roll an egg the size of Zora around and carry a dead body and carry a dead body yeah well we've got two extra pairs of hands right so uh, it's handy it's just that <laughs> weird isn't as strong as the next five know. was in armour yeah because uh, weird's also carrying his armour okay, I don't what are our alternatives though right what can we do other than yeah, taxi. carry these things is that an option you still have money, right? You could Do taxis take dead bodies around here? I mean, assuming they're even manned by people, right? I yeah, they're automated. Do they do they Another hand, do. automated taxis probably have sensors for exactly this sort of thing. Mm -hmm. But, I mean, somebody could go in first and try and fuck the sensor over. Right? <laughs> I'm just saying it is a possibility though, right? You you have yeah. technical people and you yeah, go we in, do. jam up the sensor, go inside and then to, like to break the sensor relatively like relatively difficult, not super game breaky, right? But like it's something that would be difficult because designed not to be broken. And then Yeah, hey, I've could, watched for Felvin, right? You just and, need to punch the fucking digital driver and it, it fucking <laughs> take full control. <laughs> Is that uh, <laughs> Total Recall you're thinking of? Um, uh, it Johnny Cat? Was it that? Um, Maybe it's that actually. And then you've uh, got, but that's what I was going to say, but then you could go for a really difficult thing of trying to take control of the thing fully um, and just having yourself your own personal, like, get about Castravel city vehicle if you just wanted to really break it. So you've got those options. Those are things that I imagine would come to, like, Nix's mind, or Weird's mind, I should say. Maybe they would have came to Nix's mind quicker than Weird's, but, uh, yeah. It depends how he's want to go about it. He could walk there. That obviously, I mean, he's have already been caught on who knows how many different forms of surveillance already, right? Yeah. He's have been here for at least five solid minutes talking to each other, being like, "What the fuck?" Um, if not ten minutes. So, and the fact that there is magic detected right in the center of the city. Yeah. yeah. So, it's impressive. You haven't been approached by authorities yet. <sighs> So, and then they've got um, to deal with like a former like regent of the land or like fucking queen of the land. Uh, they've also got to deal with an ex cop. Uh, no record at all of weird. Uh, <laughs> you know, probably little information about Zig and then fucking like war hero Zora. He keeps strange company. I might be inclined to sort of try and slink off and get in touch with the person who contacted me. Okay, yeah. I don't know how subtly I, I can like slink that, off. So I, like I have that, to kind of find an excuse. Like it's, <laughs> um, if you want the party to not notice, we can roll and we can see if you want it, or if you just want to tell them you're going to go and do it, Like it's up to you. But if you want to roll, that gives us our first roll in session. You know what? Let me let me roll. Let me like people are talking about shit. People are somewhat distracted. It's possible that my stealth might be sufficient. Right. So how about this then? Right. Don't roll your stealth yet. Right. Okay. Who thinks they would be paying attention enough to warrant rolling perception against Lyco like doing this? Right. And then he's gonna all roll for me. So he's gonna all roll. I don't mind if everybody wants to do it. But if you would be too busy thinking about other stuff or staring at a golden egg or whatever, that's fine by me as well. I don't mind. So, Alex. Yes. Weird paying it enough attention to warrant a roll? Well, I think he probably is because yeah. he's um, kind, of, he's kind of sitting in the background of this conversation, observing everyone. Go for yeah. it. Give him a roll. Give him a roll. 
19. I want a Zora. You're rolling? Uh, nah. Nah, I would probably be like folded the arms looking at the egg, trying to like think like what I'm today going to do about it. Okay. So, uh, Zig? I think Zig's. Um, I think Zig's kind of trying to keep tabs on everyone because he wants someone to come up with a what are we doing? Uh -huh, like a plan <laughs> uh, quickly. Yeah, go for it. Like he's, he's like he's getting a bit uncomfortable with just standing around in the middle of the. Mm -hmm. It's deep body. It's okay. fucking deep body. I'm gonna do a GM roll. Rather not break laws. Okay, I, right, Colin. I, do you want to give yep. me a Lyco roll for stealth, and we'll see yep. how well you do? Please be these. That's pretty these. That's right. Yep. I, so, describe it for me. <laughs> okay. While we're having the conversation, they'll probably be looking between each other. You know, as people are speaking, there's probably a lot of uh, not even fully conscious. Attention being paid to the egg and to the body of Escape Further. Mm -hmm. And um, there's the fact that Nyx is no well no longer Nyx. He's weird. And that's going to be something that people are still not used to. Mm -hmm. And I think, like, are going to be a little on edge about still. And, you know, you can imagine quite easily that they're sort of paying disproportionate attention to him because he is now huge and weird looking. Also, like, Kasatha by nature aren't that common and um, they're quite like reclusive in general yeah we so, haven't really encountered many so like one um, pretty much like you yeah like, bye -bye. yeah <laughs> and that's it like they're very reclusive so like maybe other people are noticing because there's like a big eight foot cassette and android holding a dead body in a power suit right. so i think like, between that the fact that the queen's sort of like probably not fully paying attention to her surroundings in the sense that she is looking at everything around her, but not necessarily paying full attention to the people swarming by her. Um, she also thinks like, think by the way. She doesn't know us either. I'll give you People that are probably... Them. Yeah, I'd imagine she may. <laughs> <laughs> um, I, it felt right. Uh, I imagine people are probably keeping an eye on her, so I feel like everyone's got their attention split at least like four or five ways. Mm-hmm. That's before you even get to the pedestrians who are increasingly annoyed by these weird people with a dead body and a glowing egg. Yeah, because it's the same as like if somebody like if you're drive like if you're walking down the street of a city and then somebody just drives their car onto the pavement and like five people get out of the car and just start talking around the car. Yeah, that's the equivalent of what you have done. Only you've it's very weird. Car. Yeah, appropriately enough. And uh, during all this, just like. you know, I find the right moment for when a you know a group are moving past. And uh, and they're sort of similar enough in general outline and style that I think okay I'll just I'll slip in <laughs> maybe some people with some slightly military looking stuff maybe some people from somewhere official or something like that I just slide in behind them mm -hmm. and and uh, yeah and presumably a few moments later someone will <laughs> look around. <laughs> Well, we'll find you out. Know. So, like, you wander off. Where, where is your head? In sp anywhere specific? I'm gonna head to probably, probably some sort of like not internet cafe, but the equivalent. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. Now you can like our space box type. Yeah, you know, yeah. So you can slink away. Somewhere and... relatively low, low rent, like not absolute bottom barrel. Space um, McDonald's or whatever. Yeah, you can go to like like Castroval's main city, um, for lack of a better. Like this is pretty much the main place you're in just now, and it is everything's pretty nice. If that makes sense, like it's yeah. I mean, I don't want to go into gentrification, but um, yeah, it's it's it's, nice. it's an upright world. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and yeah, like the lowest place you can probably find is probably like the equivalent of a really. Like a McDonald's run by like a waitress, I guess, you know. Okay. Um, so yeah, we can we can have it be something akin to like I don't know. Let's call it Rose Garden. There you go. There's our okay. sci-fi McDonald's. So it's I, it's it's a basically it's a McDonald's for people who don't want to be seen at McDonald's. Exactly. It's a it's an upstuck McDonald's. So you head to Rose Garden. Uh, yeah, and we'll come back to you in a second. Right. So. What does everybody else do? What is the solution to your problem? It's probably like 
So if we get in a taxi, surely Lyco does the set off taxis, which means Escape with the set off alarms and taxis, right? And I would turn around to look at Lyco and I'd be like, oh, God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe he got a taxi. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. Um. Can I fly down a taxi? Uh, you would just you would order one. You'd sync up to their network and just Uber. Uh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> or Spoober. 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 This is my dead logic. <laughs> my dead man logic. Mm -hmm. My advantage. <laughs> so who's syncing up their call? So presumably me. Just like <laughs> detach it from your suit of armor. Yeah. Like come as you stand there in your kilt and cape. Like, it's yep. just majestic. Um, and while I'm on coming out, I toss one over to You say what, a comms device. I toss a comms device over to Zig. Yes, I was about no to say, way. we need to go buy him. Uh, <laughs> hold on, let me just Perfect. add it to my... <sighs> Finally, comms. after a year, Zig yeah. gets his comm device back. <laughs> I've got to remember, I have it now. Yep. Zig catches it and he, he kind of clips it onto the the belt of his his um his armor. Do you like use it at all? Do you sync it up to their network or do you just? Put it no, he just he just he just sticks it there. He's pretty seventy five unread emails. Uh, it's all from Sunfax dot space. I think no, I I think um he 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 probably looks at it and he sees all the missed like messages and well, things and just marks all say, as red. I was gonna say you wouldn't say any because you haven't connected it up to their network. Oh, that's fine then. Then I don't. <laughs> you just. Um, attaches it to his belt and just you know, yep. looks pretty chuffed Good, you're connected again um, Remember they're equivalent of walkie-talkies unless you are willing to connect them up uh, to Yeah uh, But Nick, uh, sorry, weird God, that's so difficult to just force back into my head after being so <laughs> used to calling it I think it's because I'm staring at your name being Nick's 5 on roll 20 as well Let me get that edited Edited Um he dated. Mm -hmm. Just yeah. Um, are yeah. you just are you the weird one? <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's, he's the OG just one. weird. I know it's just weird, but <laughs> <laughs> weird one would be good. <laughs> so, weird syncs his form up to uh, <clears throat> the network. Castroval. Obviously, you hit OK to all the terms and conditions because nobody's got time to read that. And then, although I feel like weird probably does. And uh, saves for later. You can probably read it pretty quickly, though. <laughs> You'd think so, but no. Sadly, it's not a thing. Even in the other systems, they they highlight how computer type characters can't operate better than other people because it's like taking a screenshot of something isn't the same as processing and understanding. Strange, I know. But uh, yeah, you log on to Spoober and order a taxi, like. You can set the Taxi. destination to be the bank as well. Yep. So I request an XL. So you obviously, yep, you request XL for extra baggage, you order that, and I mean, I don't know, it's probably going to cost like. What does a com cost? And we'll see, it probably costs. I pennies, actually. It's, it's really cheap. Credits credits or something. So let's just say this is like a, I guess this is 100 credits. I can cover it. Thanks, Captain. Uh, it would need to come from Weird's account unless you're transferring him the money. Uh, so you can, uh, there's a quick. Or you can link the uh, I'll, I'll, yep. I'll give him a wee tap because we, we agreed it was I'll a wee tap. Mm -hmm. really wee thing. I'll, I need to con connect to that. I do no, need to connect yeah. to obviously get connect to my account. Then. To connect to your banking <laughs> account, yes. You'd need to connect up. Hence why it's an important question. It's a nearly like, stored cash like feature in like your <laughs> <laughs> Sadly you cleared your cash last time you went on to your bus. I've just so I've just my uh, my contactless like fucking mm -hmm. like five right, taps, right, yeah. cool sound. Yeah, you're right, sound <laughs> <laughs> Five taps and you have to put yeah. your pin in them, sorry man. Uh, fair enough, man. I don't also Ender doesn't know uh, that that is the new thing, by the way guys, just accept it. Move on. Um, do, I, do I even care? I probably do care actually about connecting. I probably shouldn't have connected. 
Maybe you cover it and I'll give you the money back later. You know, nah, I'm good for that. Chestnut, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I pay for it myself then. Yeah. It's fine. So, yeah, like. I always cover on these cars, fucking hell. Do so... you talk about the LIGO situation at all? The fact that he's gone and you're getting a taxi elsewhere, or do you not care? <laughs> he just thinks <laughs> that's <laughs> Yeah, uh, he's accepted. He'll find his fucking we'll meet him in a bar somewhere at some point later. <laughs> a year from now. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that's fine. Right, so you, you just wait about five minutes or whatever. We do that nice montage of this big kind of like essentially space bus thing appearing. Uh, like people obviously make room for it. The thing like lands, deploys its door, but kind of sides whippy door opens up, and then uh, you just can roll the egg up inside it if you wish. Um, this unless Nick wants to go in first and mess around, or weird, sorry, wants to go in first and mess with stuff. Yeah, I'll go in first. Drop the body into the seat. Buckle it in. Well, I meant <laughs> go in and disable the sensor, is what I meant, but no, if you just <laughs> head in and just. Ah, he's it using like or not. What logic, man? It's fine. Do I assume that the sensor would set it off? I mean, the it's not the worst off. logic. It's not the worst logic, right? Because if somebody dies in this place, this is a pretty high-tech city. I mean, it's up to you. You could roll a culture check and I could answer the question right away if you wanted before you get Yeah, sure, I'll ask mm-hmm. that. Go for it. 16. You're not really sure. Cool. <laughs> like, I mean, maybe. Would you design it that way if you were building a, a taxi infrastructure that's automated? Probably. Sure. Then I'll go in and hack into it and... uh Register, yeah, a reasonable amount of bodies in the machine. Yeah, what, six. How many bodies is reasonable? I think you can just break six the sensor if you wanted. Like it's. I mean, I, th- I don't want to trigger a maintenance call. <laughs> you could override this, this the much... maintenance call reporting system. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, I, I override all of the systems, and it's now our personal taxi. If you want to that, you can roll for that. I can give you yes. difficulty for that. Yeah. So yeah. you reverse the polarity of the neutron flow. Right, yeah. so you want to just take <laughs> assume control of the entire vehicle, yeah? Get connect it up to my comms, this is our gas rebellion taxi. Right, okay. So, uh, yep. user what, level 8? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Right, okay, now I've got a difficulty. Go for it. In fact, do you want me to... That's fine. I was going to say, uh, I'm going to just type in the DC anyway, because that's what it would have been. Oh no. What's yeah. the option to re-roll on this? <laughs> Where's my inspiration? Uh, I mean, have you completed a goal since our new goal system? Yes. That, that's, a, that's a lie. How dare you? <laughs> <laughs> it was worth a try. I, mean, <laughs> I can see them. <laughs> or the lack thereof. Um, so, uh, you go in, you do that. Uh, yeah, you you might want to try the same difficulty engineering check to stop the alarm. Yeah. Yeah. 27. Oh, man. You think you've stopped the alarm. The alarm stopped beeping. There we go. Mm-hmm. I pull the body in. Okay. There I go. Are you getting in, Captain? Yeah. Sure. So, so you've seen Nick's walk in, like, connect up to this taxi's, like, OS... Mess about with it till the alarm started going off, <laughs> and then it just rips open a panel in this beautifully, like you know, flush minibus, if you will. And um, I was going to say spinny bus, but that felt weird. And then um, that's maybe what it does now. And then uh, I guess rip out some wires, right? And yep. fuse some <laughs> together in a different way that stopped the alarm. And then he turns to you and says, Are you coming, Captain? <laughs> um, yeah. Okay, I'm, I guess. I'm I'm ignorant to the fact that he's failed. Yeah, I mean, yeah, sure. Yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> you don't really know what he was doing, because he didn't really talk you through any of it, so it doesn't really matter. Yeah, I mean, I, I'm ignorant to it. I mean, I don't know anything about what he just did, so I'm quite mm-hmm. done. Yeah, you're getting. Zig? Any yeah. helping Zig roll the egg in? I'll be, oh, I, 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 oh, yeah, I'll help. I'll do that. I'll do that. Well, Thanks, Captain. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah, remember the egg is big and awkward and heavy. Yeah. So it's big and small, awkward and light. 
Nice license. No, this is not me <laughs> demeaning you, Zig. I'm not. I don't think that you couldn't get it in by yourself, okay? <laughs> oh! How do you? Title of his sex. Never mind. Um, <laughs> so. <laughs> yes, I would help. So, yeah, the. The Queen's just kind of standing, staring at the. Um, minibus. Uh, I'm not. I was going to be condescending. But, um, yeah. So it's like, oh, you're RPing. <laughs> it says, why did it make noise before? Uh, a little bit of an alarm. Should we be alarmed? Uh, <laughs> should we be alarmed? <laughs> That's weird. <laughs> Cut off there. I said I stopped the alarm. Stop the alarm. <laughs> I love how it's always just like, yeah, you stopped the alarm, that seems good enough, eh? <laughs> it's not like this guy's like pretending to be, you know, the new Nix 5 and Nix 5 wasn't kidnapped or anything like that. Nope, not at all. <laughs> totally legit. <laughs> <laughs> no, I've just got trust, you know? That's a word. Um, yeah, so, and our destination. Does this take us to Akaton? Um, quite stop gap. She looks at you like slightly confused. We need to get rid of some baggage. The words. <laughs> Escape. That's just so terrible. It's, it's terrible, so right? bad. We need yeah. to get. It's pretty horrendous. I mean, it's pretty horrendous, way, right? But eh, I mean, it's it's blunt. Would you like to stop her in my vault? That's an excellent idea. I mean, and it's probably going to have to be somewhere we're going anyway. I mean... It's more of a... Yeah? Is, wait, is it... When she says a vault, is it... With a church of Abadar? The bank of Abadar, should I say? Well, would you ask her? Is, like, is that how you pose it to her? Yeah. Uh, as in with... Bank. Bank. Enough. Yes. You all came from my vault. Ah, yes. She's looking at you, confused. Did not, you just forget uh, everything we've just oh, been through? Maybe not that vault. Um, you know, Hamani having access to it and all. It's maybe not a good idea. I had forgotten it was the same vault. <laughs> <laughs> I had forgotten it was the same <laughs> vault. Well, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's On like the other hand, go for it. Right, we killed the thing. Hamani buggered off. Is it? I mean, if we, do we think it's unsafe to go there or leave things there? I mean, we know it is compromised, I suppose. But if people don't have any reason to go back, can we recode it? I'll be back at the maybe like swap the DNA signature. Well, depends. You might want to switch back into it. RP mode to have that combo then? Could we perhaps swap the DNA? Can I tilt her head and she says, Why would I give up control of my vault? Well, I'm more speaking about how Mary has your sister's DNA to get into your vault. Yes, my sister had access to my vault when she was alive. So you removed access for her? Yes. It was transferred solely to me upon her death and my oh, wow. release. That things less complicated then. Might I well, let's go back? Might I suggest you never share such a thing with a sibling yourselves? I don't imagine I will. I don't have siblings. Are we all only children? <laughs> all our maids are probably dead. <laughs> <laughs> I, I hope that was in character. Yeah, it was. Mm -hmm. Good. Good. 
And she walks up there. If you see that, she walks up the ramp and then she puts her like her hand on like your forearm or some or something, just something kind of comforting to you. And she says, "It seems we have more in common than we thought." And then she walks on board and she looks at Nix, uh, sorry, Weird, and uh, the body of Isabel, and she says, "Do you wish to carry her yourself, or do you wish to do, you know?" I wouldn't say deposit because a fucking terrible phrase. <laughs> I wish to use my vault as somewhere to keep her. Wait, so we leave in the egg at the vault? I think she looks around as if just remembering you have that, even though it's like probably standing right behind her. And uh, mm -hmm. she kind of turns around and looks down and looks for Zig. And she like leans over to look around the egg at Zig, who's probably holding it in place. Mm hmm. And she just kind of smiles and goes, The egg is not my property. I would defer. And she looks down at Zig. I think Zig would look between Weird and the captain. It's up to you, Zig. Is there no chance of Hermani getting back in? And he says that to the queen. And she like kind of like does that thing where she like hunches down and like p puts her folded arms on her, her knees. She kind of like puts her like chin on her arms. She kind of stares at you. She looks at you for like maybe a good like 15 seconds. She's probably uncomfortable for Zig or just in general, MD. Mm. And she says, mm -hmm. I don't believe I can give you an answer that would make you feel any less anxious about parting with this she motions to the egg then it stays with me and you think you can protect it if I can't it's already too late if I can't nice. no one can so, sir boy so she says so if I were to take this from you now you could stop me. I will remove you. <laughs> and she, like, she like cocks her head to the side and she like smirks and she's like, good enough. And she like kind of stands back up and she says to weird, well. I guess that'll do for now. She says, bring the body. And she walks down the... Uh, I think she'll say, bring her body, is what she would say. Mm -hmm. And she walks down the ramp. Back into, like, the... Uh, kind of street. The uh, taxi's probably starting to, like, play its automated message in, like, multiple languages. Um, probably primarily, like, Lashunton at first as well. And I... Uh, probably just state something like please seal the vehicle for transit you know or some shit like that that involves please can we go and um, mm -hmm. she kind of motions to like part of the street between the taxi and her that she's kind of cleared just by standing there people weirdly seem to just be walking around her I follow up and then she just puts her hand out and kind of clenches her fist and then a big golden door appears much like you have seen many times before Mm -hmm. Obviously, this irks so many people. Like, an old woman walks oh. by and, like, tisks and such and holds her neck scarf and shuffles by the <laughs> golden door. And um, she motions to it. I believe you're familiar. I step on through. Yeah. And, like, you step back into the vault room. There is, like, half of a dragon kin. On the ground. Is there anywhere particularly... Uh... Hannah? What's you're, the word? I was gonna say, you're the only one in uh, there. Yeah, I was, I was gonna say, is there anywhere particularly appropriate to leave her? It's... Well, if we didn't have bond this tree, yeah, that'd be a nice place, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we kind of bond that. Uh. 
Um, I'm sure one of the rooms, like, you now when you've left the vault, uh, so, like, the entrance yeah. room, there was, like, the entrance room, and there's probably a table, see, in between the two doors out of that, there's probably, like, a kind of table thing. Yeah, somewhere with a nice table. Mm -hmm. You could probably leave her in there, and that way at least it keeps it to the entrance room. Yeah. You could leave her kind of lying on that, yeah. Yep. Yep, and then you, go can, you can come back through, because the door's obviously Let's open. down. Yep. And head I mean, on back. At this point, this is when you go up to the door, and it zaps away and she evil laughs and she's only got two people to fight uh, <laughs> <laughs> divide and conquer um, you know but no that's not what happens uh, you step back through yep. she's, she's looking at you as if to say you're good but she doesn't say anything she's just kind of like standing there by the door uh, now I'll just walk up to the captain what next captain I think with that, then she'll just like unclench her fist and the door vanishes. So, do we get somewhere? So, do we to contact the ship or do we find a show to Akaton? The Queen just turns around Maybe. to regard everybody standing in yeah. the middle of this uh, minibus. Yeah. It might be nice to get in touch with the ship sooner rather than later. It'd be nice to see if Alice is all right. I guess it'd be nice to know if we still have a ship. <laughs> <laughs> True that. I'm sure she's kept it in working order. Oh I would. <laughs> this is where it's a space <laughs> whale now. I would mean, like have flashbacks here, like pulling a panel after like fucking <laughs> the gun earlier. <laughs> yep. Uh, Remember I when she dodge. had jet boots and she hit the ceiling and then landed back on the, the grating and broke the grate beneath her as well? I remember that too. Yeah. I, in fact, actually, I take that back. I would do just one slow nod. <laughs> 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 Maybe we should get in touch with the ship. Do you want me to try and open a secure channel? If possible, keep it discreet. And get on the... Uh... Cast your early in Darknet. So, you can't do that from where you are. You'd need to, like, have something with a bit more bang. Power? Yeah. Yep. To get something to the final hour. Go. But realistically, what I'm you're actually trying fish. to do is you're trying to broadcast something wide enough to hit Alice's comm. Because yeah. you haven't... I think Zora's synced up his comms with the, the final hour. Nobody else has. I'll just take his one then. Uh, so yeah, you could do that from there and try and contact the ship that way. You could speak to Finn. Or as I said, you could wide band it to Alice's comm and hope she knows how to work her fucking phone. Um, I should take the captains. None of those would be particularly secure. Like Castrovel specifically is quite a tight knit place. As I said, we had this conversation a couple of sessions ago. If you're going to do something like totally janked together and like hidden if you will if you wanted to like make it mm -hmm. thing you want to do that from Akaton Akaton is yeah. less secure you you could pay a fortune from here <laughs> you could pay an absolute fortune for some super organized crime boss to let you use his thing but he will know exactly what you've done if that makes sense or they will mm -hmm. um, he or she so let's just grab a taxi to Akaton <laughs> I mean, you could pay for transport to Akaton. Again, it'd be publicly registered and all that nonsense, but I. Yep. But I still have a. I mean, the Queen did say she would get you to Akaton as well. Yeah. So it's entirely yeah. up to you how you. I guess we go to Akaton then. On you go, Queenie. So phasing back into the uh, the mini minibus, how is uh, that conversation? How does it proceed? So you walk back up the ramp, Reed. Mm -hmm. Queen dismisses the door. She looks up towards there because she's waiting to hear what you guys have to say because realistically the taxi's no longer needed. Yeah, I was going to say that. Well, I guess we might as well go to the spaceport and then point behind me. Let's find a shuttle. I believe the Queen was going to take care of our transport. Ah, yeah. Queen. Mm -hmm. uh, um, you 
said you had transport or you could acquire transport. Do you wish to go now? Uh, try and get in touch with like once we get in touch with Ico. Maybe give weird some time to make adjustments. Or maybe you could do that in the shuttle. I don't know. I don't know these things. If they've got space, but I wouldn't imagine a passenger liner as a workbench for passengers. Uh, I'm sure someone here wouldn't mind lending me their workbench. So ideally transport with workspace would be ideal. If possible. Again, when do you imagine you will retrieve Lycle? Tinko, a we a we call, you know. Okay, so let us pause here. Oh, then we need to. We'll rewind a bit. And a uh, Lyco. Hey, hello. So we have that. We'll give him a wee phone, and then it zooms all the way through the city streets, about Zoom. five or ten minutes away, to wherever you are in a rosebud, or a rose garden, or whatever the hell we've called it. Rose garden, I think we've called it. Yeah. Probably a rose thing somewhere. Says. Yeah, but you're in the Rose Garden restaurant, and it's got those fancy backwards R's that face each other, obviously. Um, oh, of course. Covered in roses and whatnot. They're all holographic, though, because real roses are expensive. And, yeah, you get there. I... You yeah. need to... To get in, you'd need to, like, sync up your comm and bank so that, obviously, they can just charge you as you go. I'll do that. I'll do that. I'm not that paranoid. Cool. If everyone goes to the places like these, you know, yeah. perfectly normal. And you, yep, you sync up your details. It's attached to your bank account now. And yeah. You go and get a table. Uh, okay. Yeah, I go and get a table with some, some want, coffee. Yeah, and. Some... You can have like an open table near a window. You could have like a private booth if you wanted. It's up to you. There's no Open table near a window? Less suspicious. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> no, Wait, it's, can't it's tell how you like, look normally. <laughs> it's obviously just the light to have a view, right? Yeah, the, and the is. city is nice. It's a very, as I say, it's a very nice big metropolitan city. Um, and uh, I will, would I be able to, you know, sort of get a little cheeky VPN up and running? Um, is that something I can do, or am I sort of is any con connection through their system going to flag you buy, up? You could buy a VPN and then just use it. Yeah. How much are we looking at? I don't know how much is software in this game. Like, what That's a good question. <laughs> like, <laughs> no idea. I mean, let's just say fifty credits for the starting subscription, probably. Yeah, fine. Get, no problem with that. VPN, yeah. yeah, that seems right, right? I don't think that's too expensive. Mm -hmm. Quickly, quickly throw that together and having done that, I will respond to the person who contacted me. Um, I replied to like your email, essentially, or your, mm -hmm. your contact. Uh, and I will respond with... Something quick and snappy, you know. Uh, they said they'd ask, you know, sort of like tell me more about this. Also, or do you want to get like a that, computer roll for setting up your VPN? Yeah, certainly. I think I'm at least competent enough to do, or maybe not. Who knows? <laughs> Depends. I was trying to track Sorry, off anyway. didn't mean to breathe into the thing. Apologies. Uh, but yeah, now you've set it up. It's it's reasonably well. It's not like it's a difficult thing to to do. Yeah. Um. But yeah, so. You set that up, and what do you say back? Uh, uh, let me see. Something, just scream at them. Uh, uh, ah! No, uh, it'll probably be pretty quick and to the point. Like, uh, details sketchy. Can only see so much. Uh, without, uh, Risking exposure. And, uh... Can discuss more in pair. Okay. 
and the information that you seeded, right? Give mm -hmm. me the subjects, even if even if the details you seeded were wrong, can you give me the subject, like headlines? Yeah, so the gist of it would have been something to the effect of, is there a, a Vesk civil war brewing? Mm -hmm. And or, are the Vesk secretly invading? Mm -hmm. um, living Librian attacks. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh... I would probably put something else. Was that uh, living something about asks asks the station specifically, or yes, 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 yeah. Uh, and uh, yeah, I feel like I feel like it would have done something. about... Do you know anything about the stranger at all? Is that something that you've been made privy to? I know Colin knows, but I don't think so. I don't, I don't think so at all. Yeah, I don't think uh, Lycos came across that yet. No. Was I? Was I ever? No, I don't. I, I don't think so. I know Zig hasn't told MD, to be honest. So, yeah, I, I would say I am not in the know. Mm. And Zora only has that passing kind of motion of it from Matva, so yeah. I, don't think, you know about I think I mentioned something about, uh, when I was doing this, something about Aspis. I think it may have been, you know, there was like a struggle for control of Aspis. Mm -hmm. um, hinting at, but probably not stating, uh, Edgar Westland going after, going after M.O., And I might have implied in some posts that these things are connected, and I might have used some of my posts to trash some of my other posts. You know, yeah. a person who had looked at all of these and pieced them all together would probably gather that there are some threads the person is putting out, but they're not consistent always. Yeah. Like, they would probably see the bits that I was trying to get over through the noise, but I'd, maybe they wouldn't. Yeah, it's an interesting one as well, because like, obviously to some day that is so eager to get any kind of conspiracy yeah this might seem like the gold mine that they were looking for but then for people that have actual intel maybe they're like ah, i know what this person's done yeah yeah it's no it's it's, it's definitely an interesting plan definitely a likeable -like plan yeah. they'll certainly be able to see like the core bits that stay the same and the bits that change so mm -hmm. right. right okay so you send off your message and let's see can you also give me a a deception role just in terms of the way you would have constructed this stuff for me? Because I think that's probably worth... No. What's deception? Well, you've you've put misinformation out there. Bluff. So bluff. Bluff. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay. Because it wouldn't really be a computer role because typing a blog entry isn't difficult. Oh, that's... It's pretty that's good. The Actually, that's not even a good role. It's just I have a lot of bonuses. <laughs> oh, but I mean, like, for the game, it's a good role. Yeah. Uh, two seconds. I just need to edit something else. And then hopefully this should just work. I'll find out in a second. So if I move us to here, yeah, good, it did work. Just so we've got a slightly different viewpoint. There we go. Castro City. It's a terrible name for a city, but that's what it can be called for now. Everybody see that, I assume? Castro Prime, Dar wait, yep. what are you talking about? Yep. It's Castro Prime. <laughs> <laughs> so there we go. We've got some nice, nice scenery to look at. Now, as for you, Michael, you um, you get there, you get settled in. Obviously, that role is totally retroactive anyway. That bluff role. Um, yeah, when you yeah. Constructed but... the post. It's something I should have got you to do way back then. No, fair, fair. And um, but obviously it's only really relevant now. And the. Yeah, the reply you get was um, location tracked to Castrovel. Uh, are you plant side still? CC. CC? Yep, that's what. Is that what they signed off last time? That, that, it's the exact same sign off, yeah. Okay, get um, persuasion. I. Uh... 
This is when the... Oh, the is there anywhere right? So Let the, me think. So the kanji in Alibrian for Urgalas is CC, but... <laughs> <laughs> no, um, what I'm thinking is, maybe I suppose I could draw culture for this because I have been looking at maps and things, but is there anywhere conveniently public nearby that I could meet them? Like, I, mean, I don't yeah. want to give them the exact address that I'm at now so that I can sort of meet mm. them there. Yeah, no, like, there is... Um, there's loads of public spaces. This city is um, like the tourist to dream, right? So, yeah. Uh, okay, like, let's say I don't know, like, let's say something historical nearby because the Queen is probably in my mind somewhat. Yeah, so you could go to some kind of, you could go to like a heritage museum or some shit like that, right? Yeah. Yeah, like there's, maybe like, sta like the, the nice seats outside at like the bit in the first episode. Yeah, let's, <laughs> let, let's call it like the Castro Valley and Culture Centre. <laughs> Castro Valley and Culture Centre, <laughs> CCC. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, okay. Uh, yes, I'll go to the Castro Valley Culture. culture. Or Centre for Cultural Excellence, no. Or, ra or rather, I will respond with, center. yes. Culture center outside main entrance. Did you give them a time or any other information or anything like that? Um, uh, no, actually, I wouldn't give them a time. I'll say, Can you be there soon? And you send that off. I, yes. And then, I, a couple of like minutes pass, maybe. Um, okay. And then, so at this point, your calm would be ringing. Okay. Ah, I check the reply before I answer. <laughs> uh, there's no reply. Yeah. Okay. All right. So a couple of minutes first. Okay. Uh, you know what? I will answer then. Sorry, I thought you said. No. Oh, um. Yeah. <coughs> Just saying. So. Like him. Captain. So we're about to go try and procure some transport. To Akaton, basically just waiting on you. I see. Uh, I uh, I was um, attempting to uh, establish a connection with a potential source. Oh, I I don't know what they're interest is. I don't know if they're an inside potential informant in, in some organization or what have you, but some put together some things and contacted me and clearly they know something or they wouldn't have been able to, so I'm uh, I'm curious to see what I can get from them. How unnerved is uh, Zora everything he just said? <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, not really. Um, <laughs> this is just expected. That's why I keep them a bit. Like, I just like that Zara doesn't care the fact that like I was like we might be compromised. I'm gonna go check it out. Is essentially what you said. Like, <laughs> oh, I mean, compromised. It's the just what you said. Somebody's tracked me down through these posts yeah. I've made. I'm gonna go see where it goes. I may not have said exactly yeah, but that I. I mean, do you know what? I still wouldn't have took it in like that for that. Know it. It's just like that's how he finds out stuff, right? I mean, I don't know how he finds out stuff, but he finds out stuff, and that's why he's a bit so <laughs> like, absolutely powerful delegation. Like it's just right. So no, I think that delegation is. Oh, you still are part of the crew? Yeah, okay, I guess we'll do that. <laughs> <laughs> um, so yeah, but, <laughs> okay. Um, what's ETA? Yes. Remains to be seen, but uh, I should know soon. Okay. I'll uh, get back in contact within the uh, standardized uh, Pact World Hour. Mm -hmm. I would sigh and I would nod. You wouldn't have seen a nod, but I would nod. <laughs> 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 what do you mean this isn't like the Codex and Metal Gear Solid? <laughs> I mean, but it is. They're about amazing, actually. Mm -hmm. Karen. <laughs> if you really upgrade to them, those can be a thing, yeah. 
Yeah. Get a codex installed. A grand each? That seems reasonable. I mean, Lyco doesn't want to be watched. <laughs> <laughs> no, you just sent it to static filter. Yeah, true, true. Um, I'll just say, understood. Alright, Lyco. No, sorry, Quint. Quint out, because <laughs> it is a captain after all. Mm -hmm. Quint out. So official. So official. It's just, you're the captain! <laughs> so then, I think at that point the queen just looks at you, she walks up the ramp and goes, Did your ascending stone give you good news? <laughs> um, it's going to be about an hour. Hopefully. I see. And what are we to do with. And she kind of just like rubbers her hand across like the, the ceiling of the, the mini bus. Shall I, and what are we to do with this fine chariot in the meantime? Uh, let's get a new one and go, uh, go get food. <laughs> or we could just go get food. Food would be agreeable. And she kind of just nods with a smile at that. And she mm. kind of just looks down at Zig and smiles at Zig. Zig nods. I guess I would tell like roll out the egg. And I would flag down on our taxi. So you'd need to... I would, you know, it's not like a taxi moment, it's a, a another taxi, I would turn to <laughs> weird. Is this one not your liking? Um, maybe not one that might possibly be uh, a crime. I fear we risk that wherever we go, but certainly. <laughs> it's time we don't have a dead body. Yet. Um, <laughs> I believe it's your turn to pay for a taxi then, Captain. Um, <laughs> me connected to the system, you know. <laughs> is that a good idea? I don't recognise you, so who the hell is, else is going to recognise you? I mean, his entire account's in Nix's name, but yeah, okay. It's fine, once they get there, it's just the one I Also, if you want, um, while this conversation happened between him and all that, like, you can, if you want, just submit the request to legally change everything if you want. Yeah. 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 You can do that, that's fine. I'm filing my paperwork. Yeah. Mostly because that just makes everything smoother if we just say that happened. There's a standard Android form. Yes, there is. <laughs> <laughs> standard. Android. <laughs> Uh, Just because obviously androids have to transfer property a lot to new identities. I imagine that it's quite difficult for them to police, actually. Yeah, well, I imagine that for the the space census, right, the packed world census, mm. there is probably, you know, this android begat, this android begat, this, like, much like father begat son or mother begat daughter, you know, it's for that, it's very much a case of it's treated like a child. For the simplicity mm. of bureaucracy, right? Um, yep. And inheritance, I guess. Um, even if it is like the same potential entity. It's complex. We'll talk about it later. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> For the most part, there, the infrastructure has it in place. Now that you're in a, a civilized place, you can hit buttons that submit your uh, reforming mm -hmm. or reformation request, I guess it would be something like that. Yeah, you can do that. Yep. Um, so Zora, <laughs> healing another spooper. Yeah, screw it. Let's not. Let's just let everybody do it. And there, uh, let's do it. I don't understand repercussions though. I'm actually a game, and I don't want to do it. So yeah, let's, let's do it. I mean, you're a celebrity, and you're opening your comms up to like the planet network. It's not that difficult. Like, Zora's not stupid. It just mm. depends if you're super suspicious, that's all. I just don't really... I mean, do you think you're at threat by people knowing where you are right now? Probably not, actually. So, there honest. you go. Right, why, why would it bug Zora, then? Well, fair enough, kind of the same with the ship. I'm telling the ship to leave. It's actually probably, Demagesh is probably the only person that would care about that. If Demogesh is even aware of the ship. If he's even aware, and even if he was, he would probably just be like, eh? I mean, he's it's, leaving. it's assigned to the uh, Obsidian Star. 
So. Yeah. If he sees the ship, we just catch the comm signal and be like, oh, leave. <laughs> like, a lot of this depends if they're looking as well, do you know what I mean? Like, I just. It's true. Keep in mind, I don't think he's going to like, total eye on me, to be honest with you. Keep in mind, I'll like, just let you guys know stuff I think your characters would be aware of. Um, doesn't mean to say that it's guaranteed. Uh, let's just do it. I'll do it. I don't think I'm ours. I honestly don't. Yeah, so you open your phones up, sync up to the uh, sync up to the network. I mean, why would Emma always so? Care about another issue? Why would she associate like you with um, Alice bazooking her? Right. Um, uh, it's true. I mean, I'm assuming she was. I mean, I... she knows exactly. She knows all of the crew minus maybe Zig. I don't know. I don't know if it's just pure happenstance that she was there looking for me when she got bazooked, though. <laughs> I mean, you assume she was there looking for you, right? Oh, uh, that's one of us. Mm. She was there just for our favourite milkshakes in the in the galaxy. Yeah, yeah. Chili's not just like a milkshake. Who wouldn't like a milkshake? I've actually been in a pure notion for a really good milkshake recently as well. Oh. Stay oh. focused. We can talk about milkshakes. Soon. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, I would, I would phone a rubber. You know, get get myself a wee, a wee yeah, super. You know the price. Yeah, uh, pay my hundred credits. I uh, would pay, uh, say, a hundred credits. Yeah, so you transfer the monies, adjust your sheets accordingly, and yeah, good. So, where are you telling it to go? Uh, <laughs> the Rose Garden. Because <laughs> <laughs> I love how you all talk about going for a Like, who actually went to a restaurant? Mm-hmm. Catering district. You want to hire a caterer? No, I mean, just like, I don't know, food food district, you know? Food like, a, a restaurant, a, 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 what, would, what would a district be for? Well, like, are, you, food are you going place? for, are you going for, look like, budget or high, like, high end? Kebabs. Kebabs, man. Aye. Get a queen on some kebabs. So you just get some of that good low life food, man. Well, that's my question, like, what's your, what end of the spectrum? Because Lyco asked me for, like, the lower end of the ah. spectrum. I probably I'll last. I probably definitely will last. <laughs> so yeah, from. like if you sit in Google, a uh, buffet probably. Like you can find. I mean, the first thing that comes up is have you tried Rose Garden? It's probably the first sponsored ad that comes up. And, <laughs> um, yeah, and then if you want to find something in a buffet place, I mean, Rose Garden does buffet. Uh, or there are many alternative places because this is like quite touristy as a massive city. So yeah, you can find somewhere nearby. You can just go. To the equivalent of McDonald's, if you wanted, um, just uh, happen to then walk in with a Lyco just face palming as she's all walking. Um, Buffy. <laughs> but yeah, so you want to go somewhere that isn't Rose Garden, essentially, uh, or would that be the first Buffy. place? Because that is literally the equivalent of picking McDonald's. <laughs> The thing is, though, it's more to do with um, would Zora think to like, not go there, or would? Zora oh no, absolutely not. Even mm-hmm. you just go to McDonald's, man. Like, oh, let's just go to McDonald's. So if that's where you program the taxi to go, the closest one's the one like was in. Yeah, let's go. Yep. Right. Cool. So you all. So you assign that. That'll take time to get to you, and obviously take you away. We'll fade out on you just now. Like, oh. Hey. Let's fade back on you. All right. Yeah. And uh, you hang up the comm, you have no idea of the impending guests you're about to have. Um, and then after like maybe another five minutes, maybe it just comes back to you and your milkshake arrives at your table or some shit. And mm. then um, it's your lactose beverage. And uh, you... Uh, lactose shake. Yeah. I mean, I'll lose five credits, I guess, for that. And then um, yeah. the, the reply comes through. And it says, uh, arrangements have been made, uh, contact in one hour from now. And then it has a timer built into the email. Okay. I will uh, so take, so take a nice step of milkshake. Before it goes forward, the timer isn't moving, it's just there at 60 minutes, 60 space minutes. And it says, you um, get your respond. RP milkshake out of here. It says, respond. <laughs> um, and it's got a yes or no. Or like accepts decline. Yes. 
Yeah, yeah except. And then that's when the timer starts. Cool. Um, I will send a quick message. CC, obviously. <laughs> yeah. I will send a quick message rather than a voice call to Captain. Mm -hmm. um, because I'm enjoying my milkshake. <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> and, uh, and I will say uh, meeting with contact in one hour uh, ET let's see unknown Long buffet. Well, I'm meeting them in an hour, but who knows when I'm uh, <laughs> when I'm going to be free? Yeah, and I mean, for the sake of a argument, let's just say the cultural center is about forty minutes from where you are as well. Mm -hmm. So you've got twenty minutes to kill. Well, I want to be there ahead of time. Okay. I'll. Uh, Enjoy another couple of sips of my milkshake mm -hmm. and uh, get up and head there. Yeah. Carry with the rest of the milkshake. I'm not throwing it away. I was about to say that you've got to finish that milkshake. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no ways. Yeah, it's probably a pretty decent milkshake as well, as I said. Um, Michael enjoys food. He, he he's he's going to savor this fucking milkshake. Yeah, and Rose Gardner are good at what they do. Do you know what I mean? Um, so you head off and make your way. Do you go on foot or do you go like. Oh, yeah, foot and foot. Yeah, and you head off there. Maybe that's why you get your, your head start, because, again, you're not specifically familiar with, like, Castroville City. Um, not to say that you might not yeah. have been here, because, I mean... I think, you, I think you may have been here in passing. Mm -hmm. um, but, yeah, you head off then, I, and the others, you obviously get in your uh, taxis. And maybe have that shot of you, like, leaving the place and, like, sipping on your milkshake as you head couple of streets away and you turn the corner as you walk away from the camera as like the taxi arrives and all of them pile out of the taxi. <laughs> what are you doing with the egg? Just get rolled it. It's coming, it's coming with us. <laughs> <laughs> Just this it's like like it was, see if it was like a small reasonably sized egg I have this idea of it being in like a baby chair. We are not chilling this thing until it hatches, and then we're going to have a baby dragon. You're rolling, it, like, you're, you're rolling it around a city. That's what you're doing. It's not going trying to use hatch. A, a different word. Eventually, right? We're going to have our own it's child crack. dragon gold. Yep. Everybody's got to think it's my child, and they're all going to think I'm going. It's dragon. It's got to be amazing. <laughs> we're going to have an omelette. <laughs> <laughs> it's got to be a nice omelette, man. Oh yeah, dear. I think what we'll do that. here is I want to take a wee break just now. Um, mm -hmm. We'll come yeah. back in 10 oh, minutes we? and we shall reconvene then. So see you every day in 10 minutes. Bye. Ciao for now, folks. Goodbye. Ciao, Ciao for now.